let's shift, okay, to the um, canceling of um, Bull Doll. I um, absolutely adore Roll Doll, and um, his books took me to so many comforting places when I was a kid, okay? Um, I loved Matilda. Oh, my gosh. I loved Matilda so much. If you haven't read Matilda, it's about this girl. She is in a bad home, okay? Her parents are abusive, and they neglect her. Um, she is... Um, Oh my gosh, my dog is getting in my garbage can and he's being so, get out, go, go away. Hey, stop. Um, Sorry, guys. Anyway, she is in a bad home. She's in a bad home, but she is brilliant. She's brilliant and um, reads so many books. I read more books because of Matilda, okay? Um, she just loved to read. She would go to the library and um, she was just a little kid in um like first grade or something but she would read you know charles dickens and all these things and i wanted to be like that i wanted to i, I remember checking out books from the library and just having no clue what they said but i just wanted to be smart like her <laughs> so anyway um she has a terrible um um household she lives in a terrible household uh she goes to a school she ends up going to a school with a a a horrible principal, the trench bowl. Okay. And, um, and it's just so gloriously ridiculous, this book, but it ends well, it ends well. Okay. So she has a terrible household. Uh, she goes to a terrible school, but still she makes it out. She makes it out and things go well for her in the end, you know, good wins in the end. Um, and also, um, who doesn't love this? Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Um, Charlie and the Char Charlie and the Choc Charlie and the Chog. I can't say it. Anyway, you know what I mean. Um, this book is so full of beastly, beastly personalities. And it's so wonderful. Books like this are so wonderful because they they get so in touch with reality. This whole idea um, that we need a safe world is just asinine, you know, here, because it's not real. We're not going to get away from all of these terrible things, okay? We're not going to get away from racism and rape and all, all of those things that I talked about earlier. We're not going to get away from them. They're always going to be here, okay? Um, and here we have um, these children chosen to come to uh, the Wonka factory, okay? Most of them are beastly, beastly kids, okay? And they get they're just desserts. But yet the one who is still flawed, by the way, the one who is still flawed, who has displayed righteousness, gets to inherit the factory. Fantastic. Wonderful. BFG. Okay. The BFG is such a good book. Um, she's in a boarding home. You know, all of these families are not ideal. Okay. No one is living. I mean, Charlie's dad was a million years old, <laughs> you know, all of these families in Harry Potter, in, um, in the Roald Dahl books, these are not ideal families. And guess what? That's what we live in. Okay. I, I know, I know that even the most squeaky clean influencer on social media, it's not this ideal household that we've created. OK, and that is what the Bible speaks to. OK, none of us are ideal. I don't I do not think and I know that um, and I totally understand if you disagree with this completely. But I don't think there is a age bracket for the Bible, you know, and horrible things happen. You know, David, um, she, uh, David um, has the adulterous fling with Bathsheba, you know, and um, Mo Noah gets molested by his son. I mean, crazy stuff happens. Oh my gosh, Sodom and Gomorrah, you know, the angels are in the house and the men outside the door ask for him to be thrown out so they can have sex with him. You know, I mean, these are biblical stories of humanity and that's what we are. That's what we are. That's what Christ is saving us from. And, and, and this is reality. 
This is reality. Okay. So when we have this idea that it's that the norm is, is this squeaky clean, you know, wise household. I mean, it's, it's not, it's not. Okay. Um, and that is what these books are connecting with our kids. You know, they're connecting with our kids in that way that there is no squeaky clean household that has it all together. There's no squeaky clean household that has it all together and you can still grow up and you can make right decisions and you can be different, okay? You can be different and you can do your best. You can be your best with your gifts. Matilda, take your gifts. You can you can make it out. You can live your own life. You can use your gifts for good, okay? All of these books, um, even Harry Potter, even Harry Potter, all of these gifts are, all of these books are speaking to that. And that is beautiful. Anyway, 